train. Yippee! Okay, so here are the tits titting. It seems like it. Okay, so Vanya is our bitch that was picked. And Vanya actually is an OC I've had for a while. And I did play her in the Pathfinder game uh, that I play with David, um, which is good. Okay, so she is, if you're unfamiliar, her T is where you notice we're starting in solitude, right? And I did want this playthrough to be more roleplay heavy because Skyrim Sunday, I, I kind of... Oh, Caliber, <laughs> thank you so much for the prep. So <laughs> thank you, gamer. Okay, um, can I say damn? Is that a swear word? I'm, I'm gonna try to be a good noodle, I swear. I, I'm gonna try to be a good noodle. Okay, but you'll notice we're in solitude, right? Because she's rich. She's bougie, okay? So... Basically, her whole thing is she comes from a noble family and she was very gifted with magic. She doesn't come from a noble family like by blood though, she was adopted because she's just so smart and cool, right? She was just so smart and gifted with the arcade. This rich family adopted her and they're like, hey, we want you to be our heir because we're incapable of having children. And she was like, okay, because like, of course, she, she kind of had her little orphan Annie moment. Okay, she had her little orphan Annie moment, and now she's like the princess of a um, family that's really like into magic and stuff, and they're really rich and they're good at magic. So she basically gets this opportunity, and her whole thing is she loves to read. She's literate, which is not always a given, given, so given some of my characters, but she's literate, she loves to read, um, and now she has the whole world at her fingertips. Look at her, like, ugh, slay. Um, and she's trying to kind of like figure out as much stuff as she can. And actually she's married to one of my old characters, Severin, our flower boy. Um, so her, she married Severin who, cause he kind of like worked with uh, her family and she is now doing hecked up experiments and trying to test the limits of the human body with magic. So that's all a fancy way of saying is she's a blood mage. So her whole shtick is she's a very pretty dainty princess with the dark secret and the dark secret is blood magic because blood magic is a big no-no um so literally what happened in lore is severin walked in and she was like dissecting a dead body and making its blood like levitate or some crazy stuff and he was like wow that's crazy want to kiss <laughs> and then they did so she is a blood mage i did um install so for those of you who are new in town this is immersive and epic i do have a few additional mods this dress comes from divine elegance store um she also let me get to an area with some better light i love the lighting like the lighting is just mwah, chef's kiss so romantic i know if like if i walked in in a room and a hot girl was doing necromancy i'd probably kiss her on the lips too you know i'd do it so Let's see if I can go to an area with a little bit more light. There we go. So, the dress is from Divine Elegance Store, uh, which is one of my favorite outfit mods. So, she's having her little noble moment. But you'll also notice if I go, see how she has these, like, nails? Look at that! Look at her sharp little nails! Which revision are you on? I literally updated my game 30 minutes ago. <laughs> I literally, so it's the most recent revision, uh, Burke. But, welcome in, everybody! So, she's very, she's very cunty. So, that is her, um, whore? Whore, 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 whore. That is her um, noble dress. But then she also has her little adventure outfit. Um, where's her, where's her, no, where's the cool shoes? Where were the, no, those are ugly. I had nicer, there we go. There we go. But then this is her little adventure outfit. Um, <laughs> but then, and then for all of you uh, sluts in the chat, there you go. Just for a quick moment. Um, oh, I can curse again? Yippee! Okay. Uh, have you had any openings for new streams? <laughs> for those who are curious about my music studio, business is going really well. <laughs> Hi, Mammoths! Um, so I have had a few new openings, but I've had... <laughs> sometimes openings for my music school go in, like, 30 seconds. <laughs> which is, like, really good for me business-wise. But, um, I feel bad for people trying to get spots because they go really fast. My wait list for music students is at 160 now, which is kind of crazy. But anyway, back to Skyrim. So... This is her little adventure outfit. She's very cute. Our starting spells, we are starting with blood gift, healing. So she, her whole thing is her cover is like, she is a healer, right? That's her cover. She's like, oh, I'm doing magic with the human body to help people, you know? Like I'm, I'm learning how to cure their wounds when really what she's doing is like, you know how like, in Sky here's what I want you to think about. You know how like there's like ice spells in Skyrim where it's like ice shard, you know, frost. She's trying to do that with blood. Like take blood and turn it into shards and like 
kill people with it. And she's also like healing herself, but basically she wants to make people internally explode. Like you, like, you know what I mean? Like she gets like a single cut on you and she can just make you explode. That's her goal, right? She's basically using the human body as like a casting focus, right? Mmm, yummy. <laughs> but yeah, you be getting rich. Unfortunately, not yet. But once I quit my school teaching job, it's so Jover. I don't think I'm gonna be rich, but I am gonna plan a trip to Disney World again. <laughs> but yes, things are going really well now. I have found a very good work-life balance. Um, I've been very, I'm very, very grateful for all the support I get from you guys. It's allowed me to hire a video editor to stay on track with like TikToks and stuff. Um, so I'm not as overwhelmed anymore. If you become rich, don't forget us. Kalenberg, we'll go to Disney World and we'll eat all the food and we'll go on all the rides. It'll be great. We can go on like Splash Mountain or some shit. It'll be awesome. But big thing, you can forget that's okay. What we're going to start off with so here's the other thing too that i wanted to mention um the original spirit of skyrim sunday was role play right i like telling stories i like role playing my characters because i actually have a lot of stuff written for her and i've actually found my love for writing again through playing skyrim and um just having this time to like be on a break i found my love for writing again so i've been writing about her but originally skyrim sunday was built around role playing and unfortunately i got distracted by really big boobs <laughs> So it didn't matter what character I played, I wanted to touch boobs. <laughs> so we're going, we're, we're gonna be good noodles, we're not gonna fuck every woman we see. Do I have characters that are specific, that I now have created specifically that are whores to touch all the boobs? Yes, but this is not gonna be one of them. We're not touching boobs, we're being e evil, okay? We don't have time for women, we are going to be evil, so... I'm honestly not sure what we're going to do. I don't have a goal in mind. I didn't really have an idea of like a start necessarily for this playthrough. I kind of wanted to just walk around a little bit, catch right. up with you guys. Huh? Excuse me? What'd you say to me? Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. What news of Jarl Elisif in solitude? Assassins may find the woman easy prey. See, I always read this line because I think it's from Amorous Adventures. I always read it as kind of like demeaning, like, oh, she's such a frail, fat, fragile woman. Like, something like that. But, like, with Vanya, I read it as, like, she's kind of stupid. Like, she could get killed. She's too nice to people. Um, let me put on my, let me put on my cunty voice, okay? What news of Jarl Elisif in solitude? Assassins may find the woman easy prey. Oh, I don't believe those rumors, my friend. Besides, who would ever want to harm such beauty? Me! Um... <laughs> right then. <laughs> okay, and that's the quest to fuck Elisif. So we will ignore that! We're not gonna... No. No sex. I'm a good Jewish girl. I am not... <laughs> I am not going to be naughty. Okay. So, let's just kind of head down here and take in the scenery. Um, there's been a lot of updates to Immersive and Epic. Um, but welcome in, everybody. Um, and the scenery just looks like... I don't know. I... It looks so much prettier than like I, I don't know i feel like you can see the trees in the horizon a lot better like uh is it too early to have an instagram moment we're gonna have an instagram you look prettier as well let me quite stop <laughs> um can we have an instagram moment just like real quick just real quick to, to commemorate the start of the playthrough instagram moment Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, there we go. Now we'll continue. So I'm kind of taking this, and this is actually how I've written off her story in general. Um, she kind of is just leaving her comfortable life in solitude and seeing what adventure might find her. So I plan on, honestly, for this first stream, doing a lot of, like, the little baby quests. I don't honestly think we're going to start any big boy quests today. And even though I don't know if this playthrough is going to last forever, I still kind of want to do Legacy of the Dragonborn. Um, just because I feel like Legacy of the Dragonborn fits her very well. You know, the thirst for knowledge. She's kind of a character where she's being corrupted by her thirst for knowledge. You know, she starts off as a good guy, but then is like, Ooh, look at all these things that could make me so cool and sexy and powerful. Ooh, no, I think I'm going to do murder. Whoopsie. You know, that kind of vibe. So I think we're just going to kind of work our way. I mean, I just feel like we should have a goal in mind in general. I don't want to go back and do... Yeah, I don't want to go back and do Dragonborn Gallery right now. I think we're going to head... I don't know. We might honestly head straight towards Markarth. Because I like the idea, Loki, that, like, it's like, okay, rich girl out on her own for the first time. Ooh, I'm going to go visit this little city over here. Ooh, how quaint, how dainty. And then someone gets murdered in front of her in cold blood. By the way, um, if you are new here, I will say spoilers for Skyrim. Um... 
my defense is this game has been out for a very long time. <laughs> so I will give spoilers about what happens in Markarth. Spoiler, people die. <laughs> <laughs> People die in Markarth. So I actually think let's start there because I feel like her ending up in Markarth would unironically be really funny. So we're gonna we're gonna walk over there. Um, yeah, if you get spoiled, like, bro, I don't know what to tell you. So, oh, um, not to be, okay, don't be mad at me, but I did play a little bit off stream just so I could go get her. <laughs> I did have a little dress-up moment where I walked into Divine Elegance store just to get her these cute outfits, and then there were bandits there, so I accidentally leveled up. <laughs> so we're gonna start off with points in magic up. People die when they are killed? Yeah, it's crazy. Okay, I accidentally leveled up twice. Okay, I accidentally leveled up three times. Oh no, I leveled- What happened? Oh, what did I do? Oh shit. I just killed bandits! What's happening? Okay, um, ignore that. <laughs> That's okay. How did you just ignore like five levels? I don't know. I just wasn't like paying attention, you know? I picked a backstory. That's it. I did pick a backstory. I love dealing with backstories. The dealing with backstories mod is a fantastic. If you are not playing the collection and you're playing your own like um, load order, Highly recommend dealing with backstories. It's super super cool. Um, I thought it was it's a fantastic mod that lets you get really in-depth with your backstory and I I fuck with it Immensely, I I really do fuck with it. Um Bone collector. Okay, we've done the bones one playthrough but I It's been a while since we've done bones. I think we'll go to the bone zone. I think we can go to the bone zone. Bless you, David Okay, so Let's go on, and I guess we're- I know there's like a road that we can take, but I'm a little bitch. Also, the big spell we're using right now is probably gonna be, um, what is it? I have blood drain, and we're also- pro, 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 David coughed. <laughs> Goodbye, David. Um, we're gonna be using familiar, and it's in destruction, right? And blood drain. For now that's gonna be our two main spells okay so let's head over here it's still making the little level up noise if i already have nexus premium what would happen if i win the raffle you would get a free month of nexus premium so you could like cancel your nexus premium for a month and then one month you could get another one if you paid yearly then uh, uh <laughs> you know i don't know but yeah uh dealing with backstory should have a saying for adding deep stuff like depression <laughs> bro my dealing with backstories would just be like Autism <laughs> speech debug <laughs> But that's okay, you know actually no speech actually no it would be like if there was a separate skill like Wisdom low charisma high because my autism makes me fucking hilarious. Okay girl. Come on. You can swim I know the water is moving, but you can do it. Come on bestie. What's going on over here? What's going on over here? Hi. Oh shit. Okay. We're off to a fantastic start. Okay, that's the wrong one. There we go. Uh, let me get my little guy out. Aha! Oh shit, okay. <laughs> we are just going in immediately. That's my little guy. Okay, come on. Come on, little guy. Give him the suck. Okay, there we go. That the fish! Okay, get out of here. Okay, come on. There's another one over here. Hello? Th there was no. Is he running away? I'm literally just a little lady, a little guy. Okay. So the blood drain does heal me, which is nice. Is this going to be OP? Probably, but that's okay. Also, my familiar should still be out here. I don't know what happened to him. I guess he's just chilling now. Cause I don't think he, yeah, he's just, are you good? Oh, he's fighting the fish. <laughs> Did you get him, buddy? Did you get him? <laughs> he's doing the stanky leg. <laughs> good boy. Did you get him? No, he's right there. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on. Yay! <laughs> he's not familiar with the surroundings. Ayo, ayo. Okay, so, yeah, Blood Drain, I think, is actually a vampire spell. Um, but she's not a vampire. That's the big distinction to make. She's, I don't, I purposely don't want to do Dawn Guard just because I don't want her to be a vampire, right? She's not vampire. But she's doing like this kind of fucked up shit. I think that's part of the fun of it. You know what I mean? But yeah, there was another guy. Wasn't he over here? For if you are new in town, by the way, I have no sense of direction. I will get lost a lot. I have over a thousand hours in this game, but I will still get lost a lot. That's not 
fault of the game. That's just me being a little dumb. We'll take the arrow and the bow just in case. Just in case. I don't know if we're going to do Civil War questline this time. Um, but if we did, she probably would be an Imperial just because that's kind of how she grew up. You know, she grew up in solitude. So, like, if she had to pick a side, she'd probably fight for the Imperials. Um... I feel like she'd be the type of person who would find the Stormcloaks, like, brutish and, like, too good for them. What? Okay. Well, no more bow, I guess, because we have the drop it redeem. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, bow. Okay. So, let's keep heading over to Markarth and see how far we get in the night. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to... I don't know. Actually, what time is it in-game right now? Uh, it is 12.50, so it's probably a little dangerous for her to be traveling alone at night, but... Meh. Meh. It's fine. It's chill. It's cool. Let's head on over here. Hopefully I can find the road, because I don't know. So I have a question, actually, because I know Candleberg's here. Is it possible to still get, because I remember Campfire was a thing, and then Campfire is like part of the main game now, like it's part of the Creation Club shit or something like that. Am I still able to buy like tents and camp? Because I actually really enjoyed that, honestly. I really enjoyed the camping aspect of the game. So I don't know if that's something that's integrated in the collection or if that's something I have to like enable in Creation Club, but I would like to go do that. All right, let's see. Now that we're back on the road, the road. No, it's an actual road. <laughs> let's see. Where is Markarth? You can still camp? Okay, cool. So I'll need to buy one of those. Markarth is not on the sign. That's not a good sign. We'll just go this way and uh, see what happens. And hopefully we won't encounter any more bandits. But if we do, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be fine. I am debating. I would like to pick up at some point. I would like to pick up Lucian. Um, the two follower mods that are not part of the base collection, at least I don't think they're part of the base collection. Uh, feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, but Lucian and Inigo. And I would like to pick both of those up at some point because I like them. I like them a lot. I believe the last M was for Morthal. So, hey, how are you guys? Good, good, good evening. Hi. Yes. Merchant Wench. What do you have for sale, Merchant Take Wench? A look. Let's see. Adventure backpack. Okay, that's probably going to be. A good thing to grab. Um, let's see. Anything good? Lucian is and Ego is not in the moment. Welcome in the gamers. Hello. Okay, so we are gonna try to find Lucian. I think. Guide to Vivek. I'm good. Anything else you got? This is good. That's a lot of arrows, lady. Okay. I think I think that'll be fine for now. Um, let's grab some of these potions just in case. Potion seller, give me your finest potions. Mm. We'll grab these. Oh, shit. I fucking changed my outfit on accident. How did I get out of that? Hold on. Let Take me see if I can... No, I want to fix my outfit. Mm -hmm. My model has, like, these little hotkeys and shit, which are, are cool. They let me, like, toggle between outfits and stuff. But sometimes I toggle them on accident because I forget, like, what the keys are <laughs> to toggle them. And it always bothers me, like, immensely. I think it's... Yeah, that's my hat. It's one of these. Gives me back my regular OG outfit. I might just have to reload my model. Okay, don't freak out. But um, everyone gets a little freaked out by this. Don't freak out. Be normal about it, okay? Be normal. I don't have any fucking legs, okay? No one's <laughs> don't be weird about it, okay? Don't make it weird. <laughs> we didn't have legs in the budget, okay? <laughs> She's been discovered as a teacher, not a wizard on Skyrim. No, I am a wizard. I am. We didn't have legs in the budget, okay? We Who's Is Isidore? Wait, what? Why are you evil? What's going on? What's going on? Are you okay? <laughs> Listen, we didn't have legs in the budget, okay? There's no escape. Oh, hey, that's easy door. Okay. Uh, I was like, who's that guy? Okay, um, here. Hopefully, Wolf Friend can help us for a little bit. Oh, shit. Oh, he's beefy. Oh, he's a dual flip. <laughs> I think I can flip my model. Not, not in the way you think I can, but I think I can. It will look really stupid. How much do the legs in the budget? I actually don't know off the top. I've thought about, okay, can I be honest though? Like, here's the thing. I don't disrespect, like, I think full body VTuber models are very pretty and they're, they're cute. Oh shit. Ah, okay, can I, uh, familiar too, electric boogaloo. Okay, cool. Um, I think full body VTuber models are really cool, but my philosophy literally is like, Oh, I forgot I can conjure two of them at a time. I forgot about that. Yeah. Another one. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, get his ass. Get his ass. The bestest of boys. You are the bestest of boys. Thank you. Wait, foot of the mountain. What was that? Search the body for clues. Camilla's no. Let's see. Okay. So we've just been 
approach. <laughs> we just need legs and ass. <laughs> you got no legs, Lieutenant Dan. I, I kind of do want to see if I can flip my model. Hold up. Can I do that? Isn't it like a, there's like a button for it, but I don't remember. I don't remember what it is, but there is like a rotate function. I don't know what the hotkey is off the top of my head. I'm sorry. I can like become really small though. Oh, shoes, thank you so much for the subscribe. Ah, thank you, Gamer, for the 19 months. Oh, good night, Ken Lumberg. Thank you for all your hard work on the collection and for the resub and for coming and hanging out. I appreciate it. Please go get some rest. Uh, you not having legs destroys the joke. <laughs> That happens. <laughs> but yeah, I my thing is like V2 models are fucking expensive. Um and my thing is like I think the V the full body model would be pretty. Like if I ever got a full body model, I would totally get like my chainsaw and everything animated and it would be like cool as shit. But like my philosophy is like you're only gonna see the top half ever anyway. So why would I spend money on like the bottom half when instead I can get like new outfits and stuff like that, like the Skyrim model. The Skyrim model has slightly more legs than this one does though. She has, she doesn't have feet, but she does have thighs. <laughs> so like do that what you will, but let's figure out what the fuck's going on over here. Cause he just like came out swinging for no damn reason. Okay. All right, Isidore got a delivering, a delving job for us. I can't fucking read. Got a delving job for us. Meet me out uh, near Cragwallow Slope in East March. Leave as soon as you get this. I hear tell of some ruins leading into the Velothi Mountains. Just uncovered a landslide, they say. Also, if I fuck up, I I'm not wearing my glasses in real life to help with my eye tracking, so. <laughs> uh, at least Skyrim form will have the thigh fill. She will, she will. Also, I do want to do another merch run when the Skyrim model comes out. Let me know if you want like something weird, like a body pillow or something, and I'll see if I can make it happen. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is big. Fresh ruins. If we could be the first That's to pick like them over, we could be rich. Who knows? Boss. Ah, man, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Oh, no more glasses. Oh, that's my fucking hat. There we go. No more glasses. Okay. Um, Let's see. Uh, who knows what's down there, though? Bring the best gear you can and lay hands to. Pick off someone off the road with good stuff if you have to. Hey, that's me. Okay. Um, Just to get it and get to me quick as you can. Okay. So let's go over there and see what's going on because it looks like he was trying to do, he was trying to do something. <laughs> we'll take the Alki just for fun. Everyone needs a nice little drinky drink every once in a while. So we'll check out his little camp and then I guess we'll head over there just to see what's up, what's going on. I'm, I'm a slut for riches, you know, for riches and, you know, prizes beyond imagination. Look at him <laughs> swimming through the water. Okay. Is there anything still over here that we can take? Let's see. A book. We'll take the circlet. Circlets can always look cute. Let's see what the circlet looks like on her. It might be really cute. Neat art print of the various EV models. That's what I want to do, Loki. I want to make a poster where it's like all my models like hanging out. You know, I think it'd be cute. I think it'd be very, very nice. Let's see. Does that look? <gasps> Ooh. Okay. Cute. All right. I'm into it. I'm into it. Um. Let's. Here. We'll take this bow because I wasn't allowed to have a better bow because. Uh, that's just not allowed. I don't want the plate. I, 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 I can, I can go without the plate. I don't, I don't need that. Um, I almost equipped it. Let's read the adventures journal and then we'll, then we'll use this camp to go, to go night night. Okay. What's going on over here? There's something unsettling about these caravan attacks. I expected bandits, but the remains we saw were literally torn apart. Uh, rent limb from limb, yet no mere animal could coordinate an attack. Uh, on a full-size merchant train. Oh my gosh, they got a- the train got run on them. God damn. Uh, and wolves don't take prisoners. We found the trail leading up into the hills. We'll make camp here for the night and set out at dawn. Whoever, or whatever, murdered those people will make sure it never happens again. Okay. Well, um... Oh, god damn it, I pressed the button again. <laughs> I guess we'll just be in the teacher outfit for now. We'll we'll commit to the bit and where's my I have a teacher hairstyle. Hold on, where is it? There we go. We'll 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 commit to the bit and we'll we'll wear the teacher model for now. Even though my shirt says you can't see it, but it says tummy ache survivor on it. I'll move it later. So let's see. We'll go in here and we'll go night night is late as fuck is 2 a.m. And while we are sleeping, I think we can pick our first winner of the giveaway. So let's see who is going to get a free month. Of Nexus Premium once I awaken. We'll we'll draw one. Oh shit, we have a nightmare. Okay. In your dream, you find yourself in the dark forest, lit by the light of the blood moon. In the distance, you hear howling of wolves and the faint screams of men. A horned figure beckons you from a rocky outcropping, a pack of wolves at his feet. You recognize him as here seen father of man beast. In his hand is a chalice filled with a crimson liquid. Oh I, I know what this is. I know what this is. Mmm. I feel like it's 
too early, Loki. She absolutely would do it, though. She absolutely would drink the beast blood. Um, yeah, sure. We'll do it. And we'll be... God, I love the idea of hot women as werewolves. I really do. I think we were a werewolf last time. I'm not sure. We'll... Do I have a d20 on my desk? Whenever I don't know what to do, I just roll a d20. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what? I'll roll one on my phone. Let's see. Evens, we go werewolf. Odds, we go werebear. Okay, evens, werewolf. Odds, werebear. Okay, let's see what we roll. Uh, there's no modifier here. <laughs> let's see. D20? Come on, Google. You can do it. All right, that is evens. We are going, I said evens for werewolf, right? I already forgot what I fucking said. We're going werewolf. <laughs> We're going werewolf, okay? I have not prayed in a while. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, well, that's fun. Um, huh, <laughs> we should have been a were duck. <laughs> Listen, if that was an option, what would be like the weirdest animal to have like a were for? Like a were goose, a were emu? I went to a petting zoo today and I saw an emu. It was very cool. Unrelated, but very, very cool. Ah, uh, were platypus. <laughs> So let's draw our winner while um, the the werebear is or the werewolf is wearing, I guess. Uh, if you just came in, if you type exclamation mark raffle, you can join our raffle for a free month of yes, Nexus like Premium geek, on me. Make love if my muffin is not falling. That's such a fun name, by the way. That is literally the best name. <laughs> okay, let me see our giveaway. Where's the giveaway button? There's a button for this. Hold on. I have to find it. Okay. Okay. I am going to pick a winner. Let's do close entries for a little bit. And closing entries in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Our first winner of the night entries were closed. Um, we'll still have two to give away. So if you didn't get to enter for the first one, I'll still be giving away two more later in the stream. I will pick a winner. You know, a free month of Nexus Premium, please. Aqua, you're already in the Discord. DM me on Discord and I will DM me your Nexus username and I will send you one month of Nexus Premium. All right, resume entries. But congratulations. All right, let's keep going. The wear is wearing. <laughs> All Eevee models harassing an elf. Shh, shh. Okay, all right. Let's see. Uh, there's an ad break going on real quick. I'm going to take an idea. I have no idea how. Ugh, I would join, but I have no idea how to use Nexus if I <laughs> I mean, if you want to, I, um, there's definitely a lot of people here that could help you set up an account so you can start modding if you want. Yeah, let me just, I'm gonna chill a little bit while the ad is playing. Congratulations to everyone who has, um, who got a sub, by the way, in the, the hype train. Thank you so much again for the hype train. Mm. thank you so much for the raid! Welcome to the stream, gamer! How was your, how was your stream? We just started a new playthrough, and within 48 minutes... <laughs> We are a werewolf. Here, let me fix my model so I can show you guys my cool shirt. Okay, let me let me show you guys. It says Tummy Ache Survivor because I have IBS. <laughs> as soon as I read the ads came out, I'm sorry. Okay, ad should be done soon. Okay, we're just chilling. I I'm making sure y'all aren't missing any action. Okay, we're just having we're just having a very um, intimate conversation. Yeah, while the ad was playing, while the ad was playing. We were talking about monster fucking and monster fuckers and werecock. That's what we were talking about while the ad was playing. But thank you for the main master. <laughs> uh, how was your stream? Did you have a good stream? Thank you. Huh. <laughs> but yeah, this is my shirt. See, it says tummy ache survivor. Yeah, wear salmons. Yeah, okay. Now let's go. Did it say it was, what was it to turn back? It said it was like tea or something like that, I think. I'm not sure, because I don't want to stay as a werewolf, because it is broad daylight. Uh, hi, Fosby, welcome, but thank you again for the raid, gamer. All right, also, it should be, hold Z, okay, yeah, I don't want to be, there we go. Okay, now she's normal again, Yakuza Kiwami. Ooh, I've never tried any of the Yakuza games. I should give that a try at some point. I think I'd like, oh my god. Oh, it's just a little guy, here. Goodbye, little guy. Goodbye, little man. Come on, puppy. Get his ass. Okay, cool. But yeah, oh, please, thank you so much for the- Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Uh, thank, you, thank you so much for the sub. Uh, thank you so much for the three months sub prime. Um, just give me, give me a minute. 
Thank you for the raid. Oh, shit. 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 Okay. Okay. All right. It's like Dark Souls. I, I have to, like, unlock on if I want to move. <laughs> Learn Mahjong. I feel like I'm too stupid for math. Ah! Okay. Okay. I know I can just go into my beast form, but that's cheating. Okay? All right. We have given the suck, and now he's dead. That sounds exactly like what you think it does. But thank you, everybody. I appreciate it. Get out of here, Mr. Mudcrab. Wait, why do her hands... Oh, it's because she's wearing gloves. But she still has the nails. What? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Did you, did you see the, the angle? Oh, and it's raining now. Oh, okay. What? There's... Uh, we're done. We're done. Okay? We're done. All right. That's what I want to do. Okay. Foot of the mountain. And then... Yeah. We don't need the Sophia tracking marker right now. Okay. Let's go. We now have a side quest. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you gamers. We are going to go investigate the mountains that were talked about in the the little note that we got Because I do think that'll be funky. Where is that? Is that all the way over here deadass? Okay, well, we're not gonna do that right away um, We're gonna go to Markarth and watch someone get murdered because it'll be so cute and fun and quirky, you know All right back on the trail <laughs> I can't believe we got the werewolf nightmare thing literally within like 30 minutes of stream. That's crazy You know, but yes if you type exclamation mark raffle we are giving away two more months of nexus premium so that way it makes it easier to that's what we were talking about before that yeah if you are like i want to enter the raffle but i don't know how nexus premium works um if you join the community discord which i think should work if you take a submission mark discord there's lots of people there that are experienced with skyrim modding that help you set up your nexus account uh how to install the collection and also the collection i use uh immersive and epic has a very very active community discord as well um which i don't have the link for on hand but i'm sure someone a mod can give it if you type do i have to re-enter i don't think so i think you should be if you already entered you should be good let me make sure i'll double check yeah if you already entered you're good your name is still up there the only name that is gone is aquas um because he won already <laughs> And you can't win twice. If you try to win twice, I'll kick your ass. Uh, <laughs> it only works once. Yeah, so I think you're okay. I think you're good if you already entered. But yeah, it doesn't allow dual entries. There was an option to make it so, like, if you were subbed, you got, like, bonus entries. But that didn't seem fair to me. So I was like, I'm just gonna make it simple. We're not gonna complicate things. Fair is fair, you know? I feel like I give this area... Oh, shit. That's another one. Um, do I have any, like, spells I can use at a range? Uh, you and what, like... That's a low blow tap. That's a low blow. <laughs> Listen. Okay. Um, do I have any spells that are like range that I can use? Because blood drain is like a... You know what I'm saying? Um, hmm. There's sunfire. Ball of sunlight that does 28 points of damage to the undead. Well, that's not going to help when... It, it, it's very much alive, so that's not gonna help us, unfortunately. Um, everything's a low blow when you're that. Shut up! <laughs> don't be me, <mean> Debbie! <laughs> um, I don't think fornicate's gonna help us here. I'm gonna be. I'm spread the, I just noticed the fucking. Spread the love. That's so. That's that's nice. It, I don't think that's gonna help us either. Okay, um, do I have any cool powers we can use? <sighs> Here's the thing, is I can just turn into a beast. I kind of want to save that, though. I don't want to... We have this new power. I'm afraid if we use it too much, it's going to get to our head. And I still want to, like, do regular shit. You know what I mean? I still want to be normal, okay? Um, yeah. Let's just keep conjuring shit. Um, can I conjure a flea magic? Do I have enough magic for that? I do. All right, get out there, bestie. All right, come on, queen. Oh, it's raining. Are you going to be okay? Wait, no. Queen! Come here! Come here! Come here! <laughs> All these modded spells and no testicular torsion? I mean, hypothetically speaking, if she's a blood mage, I think she could, like... I think we can headcanon in that, like, yeah, she's draining blood, but from where? You know? Like... <laughs> I think she can torsion all the testis... Ah! Anyway. I think she can torsion all the testiculars if she wants to. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think it's... Wait, what is that? Oh, I accidentally have two conjuration spells out. Okay. Honestly, being able to have two conjuration things is, like, crazy. That's nuts. Um, but I like it. It's like I, I don't need to make friends because I have friend one and friend two right here. 
you know? And yeah, they'll die after a certain amount of time, but then I can just make a new friend. So like, who needs friends when you can conjure wolves and flame atronarchs to fight for you? You know what I'm saying? I'm not coping, you're coping. Ooh. Okay, let's go on the bridge and not try to parkour our happy ass over there. I feel like going the safe route will keep us from falling to our death and then me getting clowned on by chat. Twisted dick! <laughs> okay, so there was something I wanted to tell you guys. Oh yeah, okay, while we're just like walking around. So David and I went on an adventure today. Uh, if you're subbed, I did post IRL pictures from the adventure into the um, blog channel. But David and I went on an adventure today and we went to, we went to this like local farm place um, and we picked our own apples. It was really, really cute. We went apple picking, but they had a petting zoo there. And at the petting zoo, I thought it was just gonna be like, I, I don't know what I thought. I thought it would just be like normal petting zoo shit. Um, but they had like three goats and the goats were <laughs> David fucking dead ass like pointed to one and he was like, it's your favorite Skyrim character, a goat. And I was like, oh my God. But they had emus. They had fucking emus and peacocks there. I was like, damn. Oh, dead worker. Oh shit, that, that sucks. Um. I'll take the nails because I kind of want to do Felberg this run. I feel like Felberg would be fun, especially since she's a noble. But yeah, they had emus there. I thought emus were like, like, I, how, how the fuck did emus get into the fucking East Coast? I thought they were like an Australia thing. Like, did they import them? I don't know. You know, I was just like, oh, what? Okay, Markarth is this way. But like, it was very fun. I enjoyed the petting zoo a lot. And we got to have a frozen apple cider, which was very, very yummy. Australia mentioned? Yeah, we had emus at our local petting zoo. And I was like, huh? Huh? Th I did not pet the emus. I, I feel like the, just the vibes they were giving me were not like I want to be pet vibes. You know what I'm saying? Like if, oh, hey. Who, 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 are, who are you? Okay. Wait, what? Oh, that's just a horse making noise. Hey. Hmm? Hmm? Okay, you guys are too cool for me, I guess. Um, they were those escaped zebras last year. People do be important animals. Yeah, I guess that's true. I just, like... Yeah, I, I was like, emus are, like, an Australia thing. There's no way emus just, like, got up and walked to fucking Baltimore, you know? <laughs> I feel like, you know what, given the... I, I feel like emus would survive in Baltimore, though. I think they'd be okay. I, I think they'd assimilate very, very easily. <laughs> but yeah, um, we, we I thought about petting the emus, but I did not. Um, I didn't pet anything, actually. I'm really squeamish. You know, David pet a few of the animals, you know? <laughs> but I just, like, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm a baby, but, like, I'm always worried about, like, if I pet something, I'm like, what if I get, like, cholera on accident or something? I, I, I know that's not, like, the diseases animals carry. At least I don't think so. I'm just naming shit off the, my, the top of my brain, you know? They're named to the eastern coast. They, oh, so they feel right at home then. Okay, well, that's nice. But um, emus want to war against... That's what I'm saying. I'm like, I could be in the presence of, like, war veterans, you know? I want to be respectful. The emus did win a war against Australia. You got to be respectful. Virginia's for lovers and Maryland's for haters. <laughs> Honestly, real. Honestly, very fucking real. But yeah, it was very cool. Oh. It was everything okay? Are you doing all right? Hey, I'm not gonna hurt. Oh, there was probably a battle here. It looks like the Imperials uh, didn't do so hot, huh? Do you guys have anything I can take? Uh, I'll take your arrows just in case. I don't want to use a bow. Bow is very much a last resort. Oh, Frostbite, thank you so much for the Prime Sub Gamer. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. I appreciate you for six months. Thank you, thank you. You have six place. What? Hey! Oh, it was not the storm cloaks. It was the force one. Okay. Um, another one. Okay. What? What are they gonna do against like two of those? You know what I'm saying? Like, there's no way I lose this. Okay. Yeah. Do your thing, girl queens. Do your thing, girl queens. You got this. Okay. Is one of them dead? I think one of them's dead. Okay. I, I don't think we need another one, honestly. Okay, but we'll put another one out there anyway, just for sillies! Okay. Okay. Is that all of them? I, I think we're good. I was like, oh man, the, they lost the battle! Ugh, no, it was a fucking force ward! Okay. Well, that, um, adds up, I guess. You good? I've been looking for you. <laughs> I've got something I'm supposed to deliver. Uh, yeah, he's fine. He, he's good. I he's fine. He's you. fine. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Yippee! Moving up in the world, eh? Let's see. Looks here. like that's it. Got to go. Oh, God damn it. 
Um, I think this is Forgotten City or something like that. I don't remember, but I, I, yeah, that is Forgotten City. I love Forgotten City as a mod. Don't get me wrong. But as soon as it, the letter starts talking at me, I'm like, mm, shut up. Okay. Is this just him telling me he has room for a Thane? Yeah, that's just like Thane of Falkreath. Okay, cool. Uh, Emus in America were brought over for farming purposes. Oh, interesting. I never knew that, actually. Okay, let's keep heading to Markarth. What's in here? Pavo's house? Okay, I don't know who the fuck Pavo is, but hopefully he's not one of those guys. <laughs> Alright. Let's keep going. We'll make our way to Markarth and we'll see. We'll see what the fuck happens. You know? But yeah, I always like... I don't know. I want to go to Australia. I actually have relatives over there. Um, and I've never visited before, but I'd like to visit one day. I think it'd be cool. Hi, Leah! Welcome! Evie's back and more unstoppable than ever. Damn right. Emus were gonna be the next red meat, but that never took off. I always, like, this might be controversial. I always thought it was weird when people, like, freaked out about, like, Oh my god, people eat, like, this animal. Oh my god. It's like, animals serve, like, different purposes and are hold held to different values in different cultures. I didn't think that was, like... A crazy concept, but like it's like oh people in this part of the world eat this people in this part of the world eat this Just remember EB the second you accept foot in Australia. You will be called a fat cunt. So it's like high school. Okay, got it <laughs> All right, let's over here This is that's right. Isn't this like a little farm outside of my car? Hi Salvia's farm. Oh, okay. Wait Look at that chicken. Wait. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. For a split second, the way this looked, I was like, is that chicken wearing a bra? Is that chicken wearing a fucking bra? <laughs> That's what I thought it looked like for a second, but it's the little, the little flippy flappies. I just, it just, <laughs> it looked a little boob shape, so I was like, the chicken's got Victoria's Secret on, goddamn. <laughs> okay, all right, what's going on over here? Hello. What happened to oh, you, there's Pablo. Pablo. The Forsworn have taken Kolskager mine. We're the only ones left. Oh, God. You two head inside and get some rest. I'll send word to the Jarl. Um, are you guys good? Damn Forsworn. Only a matter of time before they hit here, too. Um, uh, what's all this about the Forsworn? Because I act. Oh, wait, I have to roleplay. Shit. What's all this about the Forsworn? I actually ran into a few over there. Seems or past there. I'm bad at roleplaying. Here's the thing. The thing with me roleplaying this character, she's really smart. I'm not. So I want to sound smart and say smart things, but I can't think of that. <laughs> and I have no social skills. I'll think of the hydrate, Master. the Jarl about this, but I don't know when help will come. I can take care of them, me and my army of baddies. I'm sure Pavel would be grateful. And we'd all rest a little easier. That's Lighting nonsense. is really bright. I think it's just because it's focused on him right now. Forsworn by yourself. If their axes don't get you, their magic will. Uh, okay. Let's give it a try. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go in. I think we can clear this pretty easily. Uh, yeah. I think it'll be fine. Where's the mine? I think it's up there. Would you like a reading list with big words? Shut up! <laughs> all right. Here we go. Right. I'm good. I'm about to save the day because I'm just so cool and fun and sexy. Okay? Alright, let's head on in and see. Let me check my spell. Oh. Low key, the spells in the dark look so fucking good. Wait, look at how they glow like off my nails. Mm, I fucking love good light design. I'm a slut for good lighting. Okay, let's see. Nothing over there. Mushroom. Mmm, just some iron. Not a very valuable mine, but that's okay. Uh, a book? I- I do love books. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, I think it's back there. Iron boots. I'm just ex- I think people are just mining back there, so I think we have to go down. Although I'm not sure why people are mining back there if a bunch of people just fucking died. I mean, hey, if they're on the clock, I guess. <laughs> Can you imagine? It's like, hey, I know someone just died, but um, you don't get off till five, and we don't have someone to cover your shift, so you're just gonna have to, you're just gonna have to deal. Hi, Rainbow, welcome in, gamer. I'm saving the day from the Force Ward. Once I figure out where they are. Oh shit. Oh, I'm hidden. Uh, is that a guy? Are you are you a friend? 
Are you a friend? Okay, I think that's a friend. I think that's a friend. Okay. Um. Hmm. Where are the force born that I'm supposed to kill? Do you know? It's amazing how much work goes into the little things, isn't it? Okay, you have no fucking idea. Fantastic. <laughs> so there's somewhere. This is Kolskigur mine, right? No, this is left hand mine. I'm an idiot. Okay. Um. <laughs> I really was like, okay, mining time. <laughs> time to go to the mine. And I just did. I don't know what I expected. <laughs> I really don't know what I thought I was doing, but that's okay. Force runner down the road? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Well, you know, we got to go say hi to old Willie, I guess. We got to make a new friend. That's fine. You know, it's chill. It's cool. All right, well, we'll keep heading over. Where is it? That's the ruins. Here, let me make sure this is ticked. Um, okay. Oh, it's not far. It's only 300 meters away. We'll head over there. Hi, puppy. Hope Pavel will be able to go back to his mine soon. Everyone needs a home. I, I I don't know if the mines are his home, sweetheart. Um, that's kind of dystopian for you to say that, but you're like five, so I'm not gonna question it. You know? <laughs> can you imagine that? Like, like something fucked up happens at your job, and your kid's like, "I hope you can go home soon." What what, what do you say to that? <laughs> Pavo's a Minecraft player. Damn, that is crazy. Uh, I'll run my own stealth archer with blackjack and hookers. No, no, I'm being a good noodle and I'm not playing a stealth chest, okay? All stuff is in a handful of chests underground. Mm, interesting. Okay. So let's head over here and clear out the correct mine. <laughs> the right one. <laughs> okay. Uh, is there any goodies over here? I see a red thing. Oh, that's just alcohol. And fish! You know... I don't think I've ever gone fishing in Skyrim. I think I literally just wrote it off as I was like, this is stupid. <laughs> like I saw Anniversary Edition come out and I was like, damn, all they did was add fishing. This is fucked up. And I just never touched it. So you know what? Maybe, maybe I'll get, uh, maybe I'll do some fishing, okay? Women want me, fish fear me. Maybe th this will be the playthrough I try and leave. I finally try fishing, okay. Let's go over here. Yeah, there's fishing in Skyrim, bro. So advanced, such technology. Fishing was added, added after my time in Skyrim. Well, hey, now you gotta try. Look at your stupid little run. I'm sorry. I love her so much, but she runs stupid. I don't know. Like, is that just me or does she look a little goofy? It's okay to look a little goofy. Fishing only playthrough. I would honestly love if I could do a playthrough of Skyrim where I could play it like The Sims, right? No adventuring. I just want to be a humble fisherwoman and, like, fuck bitches and sell fish right fuck bitches get fishes you know what i'm saying <laughs> like give me fuck bitches get fishes that actually kind of goes hard not gonna lie but welcome in garlic burp let's see what's going on in here this is where the oh oh there's a guy over there i don't know why i'm sneaking when i know i'm just gonna spawn my woman and it's just all hell's gonna go to shit okay i don't know <laughs> misty and fishes yeah me and my me and my beautiful wife, Misty Sky, fishing. Okay, here we go. All right, I'll let my women handle it, and uh, we'll just see what happens. No, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, no, don't hit me. Thank you. Perfect, okay. Um. Oh God, they look so good in the, in the dark, Loki. They look really pretty. Wait, when they despawn, are they gonna explode? Or do they only explode when they like die, die? Cause that, Oh god, the Briarheart's somewhere over here. Because in a, a closed space like this, that could be an issue. Um, you know what, there? You guys doing okay? Okay, I really hope they don't. I'm, I'm gonna save, actually. Because, um. Yeah, you guys go off. Because I'm afraid that they'll just despawn and explode. And then I'll fucking die. Wood? <laughs> Wood. Oh! Uh, yep, okay, so they just. They just explode. Although I think that one might have died. First view, then all of the reach. Um. You doing okay? Do you want a friend? Hey, go have a friend. Okay, where are you? Okay, you're over there. Okay, that should be good. Um. Show me what you've got. Okay, I don't need another one. Here, ladies, over here, ladies. There you go. Sometimes they just don't know where to go, and that's okay. God, the fire effects. Oh shit, she's gonna explode. Oh no, she didn't. She just kinda, okay. Huh, all right. Is 
There we go. Alright, one more. Finish him off with the suck! Okay. I think we got everybody. Well, no, it would have said if we got everybody. So there's still some laying around. Actually, let's go loot the Briar Heart and see if he has any good loot. Because he's the big boy. Uh, that's just a regular Force Warrant. I, I don't think I need a. Wait, actually, no, I do need a rib cage. Because I need to get bones, right? Yeah, I need to get bones. Oh, I need to collect their bones! I forgot about that. Give me your bones. Give me your bones. Ah, uh, bone. Hit bone. Left hand. Left hand. Right hand. Oh, Mickey, that's it. Okay. Um, let's see. What's going up over here? Pay the bone tax to the blood mage. That's right. I think this doesn't work in first person. Oh, okay. Can I climb up? There you go. Cool. Okay. I forgot about all the ladders and, like, other cool stuff added by this mod pack. Okay. Let's keep exploring. But Okay. It is cleared, though. It is cleared, which is cool. Is there anything else, like, cool over here? I did climb up here. I want to see if there's anything nifty, you know? Marrow is actually where blood is produced. Oh, okay. I don't know shit about biology. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> yeah, you could be totally wrong, and I'd believe you. <laughs> okay, let's go over here, I guess. Yeah, I guess it's all good, then. There doesn't seem to be anyone else over here. I do like the lighting in here. Like, it's kind of dark, but I, I, I dig it. You know what I mean? I, I kind of fucks with it. I kind of fuck with the dark. Okay, we'll take your bones. Yeah, because isn't it? I think it's like, um, I, I need to go back and read it. Marrow is tasty. True. Hmm. It's something in conjuration, right? Like, I find a bone altar. Find 11 types of bones on humanoid corpses. Four bone altars are marked on the map. At a bone altar, convert one of each bone into a skeleton warrior. Skeletons do not count against your summon limit. Enemies can temporarily defeat them, not... Oh, I can't... Can I read the whole thing? How do I read the whole thing? <laughs> How do I read the- I can't- I guess we'll never know. Alright, that's fine. It's fine. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh, I'm glad to be back. I was literally looking forward to this all day. I'll be honest with you. A lot of times when I start stream, I literally just kind of roll up in my underwear, turn on stream, and I'm just like, Way! But today I was like kind of nervous, but I was also excited. So I literally just sat here like an hour beforehand and was like, hee hee. Hee hee I streamed today. Hee <laughs> hee. It's stream day. Yippee. Okay, let's go tell Pavo that the mine is all A-OK -okay cool beans. Can I just, um, I'm lazy. Can I just do one of, <laughs> can I just do that? Because I'm lazy. <laughs> Here, I'll alt tab and see what the poll is doing in a second, okay? I think we're pretty close to Mark Hart, so we'll see what's going on over there. <laughs> oh, also, um, I did think that we're going to try to do all the Daedric quests with this character. Because their whole thing is like, forbidden knowledge, woo! So I do want to see if we can do all the Daedric quests with her. I think that would make a lot of, I think that would make sense. I think it'd be a lot of fun. Because I don't think we've ever done, I don't think we've done most of the Daedric quests. We've done some Force of them, but not all of them. Lost, friend. Forsworn killed everyone. Well, I, oh, right. Kosuke Grimine is clear of the Forsworn. Because you I clear, kid, cle killed everyone. We'll that was in right character away. versus out character. Take this. It's the least I can do. Oh, well, that, oh shit, he gave me 750 gold. You can't see it because my fat ass is in the way, but that's okay. All right, I'll take the 750 gold. Hot damn. All right, we're very close to Markarth, though. So let's head over there and we'll see. Wait, why does it say I can no longer enter the raffle? What the fuck? Did it close? I mean, I can pull another one if that's what... Yeah, wood. <laughs> I'm glad wood is winning. I'm glad wood is winning. Okay, well, we'll pick another winner then. We'll pick another winner. So let me do this. It doesn't say entries were closed. Let me do this. Okay. We'll pick another winner. Da -da -la, just because the thing is being weird. Close entries. Close entries. If it'll let me. Let me refresh the page. The page. <laughs> it's being a little silly. But we'll pick another one right now. There we go. Okay. Pick winner. Boop. Pasta! Pasta, you have won a Nexus Premium. Congratulations, gamer. Please message me on Discord and I will get with you about your Nexus Premium. But congratulations. Okay. It has restarted again, so if you'd like to enter again, feel free. Okay. Let's go. That's right. You got Nexus Premium, bestie. You entered the raffle. You were there. <laughs> you were there. <laughs> okay. Let's head up over here. And I think this is the way to Markarth. I don't think I've been to Markarth in a pretty long time. I know, but I never win anything. Well, you won! Congratulations! That's how I always am with raffles. I'm always like, if I ever win anything, I'm like, oh my god, I never win anything. 
Because I, I also do not win things very often. I've entered so many raffles for like art and stuff like that, and I never win, so I feel you. But congratulations! Now you have won. And we would all fuck the flame at Shinark. Thank God. <laughs> Thank fucking Christ. All right. Welcome to Markarth! Welcome to Markarth. It's been waiting for you. Welcome to Markarth. I, I don't know anything about Taylor Swift. I just know she has that song. <laughs> Yippee! My God! You there. The Dawn Guard is Wait. looking for anyone um, willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? Welcome to my God! <laughs> it's been waiting for you! Welcome to... <laughs> oh! I die for my Damn, that's crazy. Wait, are you gonna come back and tell me about the Dawn Guard? Stay back. Yippee! Crime! How you doing? Ooh, key to her house. Wait, I know this woman was just brutally stabbed, but can I take her bones? Can I take your bones? I, I don't care what the fuck you're up to. I just want your bones. God, a woman attacked right on the streets. Yeah, that's crazy. Did you see what happened? Um... I must have missed it. Someone was telling me about the Dawn Guard. I know you can save her, but I thought it'd be funnier if I let her die. <laughs> Which is really fucked up to say, but... Marka! <laughs> uh, I, I must have missed it. Sorry, because she was uh, getting talked to about the Dawn Guard. You don't have to say sorry to me. I just hope the aid bring us more peace in the future. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. I didn't drop anything. My note. No, that's yours. Must have fallen out of your pocket. No, it's not. Uh, <laughs> I wish she could just go back forth and be like, mm, no, it's not. I've never seen this before. <laughs> uh, do you know anything about the attack? My note. <laughs> Must have fallen out of your Did pocket. Did I click the wrong one or is that just what he said? Okay, I clicked the wrong one. I really thought that was just his dialogue response for everything. No. I was just getting <laughs> some fresh air. Add one too many pints of mead at the Silver Blood Inn. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, let's read this note. I'd better get going. Yeah, you'd better get going. Hey. Okay, no women. No women. We're role-playing. We're role-playing. <laughs> okay, let's, uh... Oh, we have all the missives over here. That's pretty cool. Let's read what's going on over here. Okay, let's, let's read through our little note. Is it the anonymous letter? No, that's something else. That's the zombie thing. A group of necromancers are experimenting with conjuring zombies. Oh no, that's crazy. Oh my god. Um was it a stranger's plea? Uh This is not the Force One conspiracy, but I want to read this actually. I come to you with an urgent plea. I've done unspeakable things which I have come to regret, and the consequences are imminent. If you know of the Oblivion Crisis, then you know I make no jest when I say the fate of Tamriel is at stake. Oh, Fantastic, okay. It would be safer for us to speak further in person. Please meet me at the Shrine to Stendar located between Fort Greymore and Rorikstead. I will lay bare my sins in Stendar's presence. Perhaps he will grant me forgiveness. Okay, interesting. Um, all right. Um, it was, I'm still looking for the actual note. Was it this one? Note from Eltris, I think? Yeah, that was his name. What'd that say? Meet me at the Shrine of Talos. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess we'll meet him at the, the Shrine of Talos. Clearly, something is a must. Gaslight Gatekeep There's Gatekeep something. Oh, Jack, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. You're not Gaslight Gatekeep Girl Boss. Uh, we just saw a lady get murdered, so that's cool. Also, if you hear a little bloop, it's because David stopped playing games on Steam. <laughs> so we now all have access to David's Steam library through family sharing. Thank you, David. So cool. Um, no hmm? No problem. Yeah, okay. Thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go to the Shrine of Talos and see what this guy wants. We're gonna walk over there. Surely nothing weird will happen <laughs> at the Shrine of Talos. Hey, man. Bloody enough for you, outsider. Uh, more blood is always better. Then you found your home, friend. Blood and silver are what flows through Markarth. Welcome. Oh, okay. What do you mean by blood and silver? It's right there in the name of the most powerful family in Markarth. I'm glad the that he's telling bloods. me the lore instead of they just explaining to it, like, like instead of just being a bitch, that like that one motherfucker in um in Riften. I don't remember what his name is, but he's like, "What do you mean you don't know this person, you fucking out. idiot?" Whereas this guy's like, "Hey, rest, they check with it's fucked first. up, but I'll tell you what you need to know. Uh, you live here? No, 
I live in a nice house in solitude. Okay, well now you're being mean to me. Smoke from the silver smelters and golden-haired girls shine my shoes. I'm a golden-haired girl. Been here ever since I left the, the hair flip college. was so well Turns done. Out a few muscles earn more gold than a damn loot. The silver bloods pay me. Fair enough, me though. Fair enough. And keep the I mean, it would make sense that people look down on That's her because she I is mean. literally just noble pretty girl off on her own for the first time like she she's gonna ask stupid questions yeah maul that's who it is he's a dick all right well let's see what's going on yeah yeah and we'll keep heading to the shrine of talos then hopefully nothing weird will happen <laughs> all right let's follow up on the letter ignore the tits just don't look at them all right hey i'm sorry to drag you into mark Hearth's problems but after that attack in the market, I'm running out of time. What happened? You're an outsider. You're dangerous looking. I don't think I no, am. No. Why are you... What, what are you talking about? You want answers? Well, so do I. So well, does no one needs to raise your voice at me, sir. The man goes crazy in the market. Everyone knows he's a forsworn agent. Guards do nothing. I mean, the guards did kill him. Mess. I'll give him that. You want me to find out why? This has been going on for years. And all I've been able to find Most is of the NBCs in blood. Skyrim are mean. Well, they could help. just be a little Please. nicer, you know? You find out why that woman was attacked, who's behind Waylon and the Forsworn, and I'll pay you for any information you bring me. Okay. Um. Uh. Who was Waylon? Where did he live? He was one of the smelter workers. I don't know if you've ever done this quest on We, we probably have, but I think it's been a long never time ago. much about Waylon, except he lives in the Warrens, like all the other workers. Uh, what do you know about Margaret? She's not from Markarth. I'm not gonna do the character voice if I'm asking like general questions. This I'll do the character voice if I'm being sassy though. <laughs> um, you've looked into these murders before though? Yes. It all started when I was a boy. My father owned one of the mines, rare for anyone who isn't a Nord. He hmm. was killed. 40% are mean, 60% are racist. So they're really, the they're really all mean to some degree. To oh, good night, Master. Thank you so much for hanging out. And thank so you again far. for the raid. I hope you have a good rest, Beaver. Have a child of my own on the way. They are in the middle of some. That's true, but like, for my child's sake. I don't know. I think we could just be chill. You know, like, you know, just like, take a chill pill, eat a cookie, do an edible. It's not that serious, you know. Ah, okay. Let me know as soon as you found anything. All right. Well, I'll get looking, I guess. All right. Let's see. Who can I talk to? So we have to find evidence about Margaret and find evidence about Waylon. And I think we can just go to their houses for that, deadass. I don't think we need to, like, do anything, like, crazy. Okay. That one's below. Both of these are below, I think. Yeah. Yeah. I think we literally just go to their... Whoop! Uh, they're reforming the Dawn God. Yeah, Empire. some guy talked to me about it before someone was the brutally fort, murdered in the streets. Huh? Who are you? Why are you bothering the outsider? You came up into my face. Okay, bye. I should get back to work. Money doesn't count itself. You are literally Outsiders just Nazim too. Holy. Let's keep that in mind. Well, I just why is everyone so mean to me? Look how pretty I am. Why are you so Okay, to be fair, I do have resting bitch face, but like I'm pretty. Okay? Stop being mean to me. Okay? All right, let's see what's going on over here. We'll find evidence about Wayland first. Into the Warrens we go. All right. Let's see. All right, it's very bright in here. I do like the lighting in here a lot. Let's see. Um, is there anyone we can talk to actually? Yeah, let's try, let's start talking to people and see what happens. The Warrens isn't a place. Don't you a vampire? The dog guards gave her. Well, she's want? not a vampire. But she is a werewolf. I ate too many wings. No such thing. Uh, did you know Waylon? Oh, yes. I know everyone who sleeps in the Warrens. Kind of the one who passes the keys around. I guess someone else will be taking his room now. Uh, can I have the key? Sorry, but you don't exactly belong. All regret is me buying Starfield. <laughs> Real. <laughs> Real. <laughs> um, it's important. Trust me. No, it's not. Trust me. Okay, how about this? Welcome to the Warrens. Yippee! I love being rich! Okay. Let's check uh, it out now that we have the key then. Let's see. Money buys you lots of things and Mark Arth, it seems. Alright, let's go... Hmm. Wayland's room. I'm assuming it's gonna be one of these doors. The Gain's room. The Gain these nuts in your mouth. 
Wayland's room. That's Eltris's. Here we go, Wayland's room. Uh, let me just, uh, excuse me. Don't mind if I do. Alright, here we go. What a spacious room for me to search. Um, uh, <laughs> blood and silver running in my guys. Oh, here's a note. Ooh, and some money. Okay, I do want the money too. Okay. Is this. Yeah, okay, that's the same door as before. I want to double check. All right, let's read the note and see what's going on. Okay? Let's take a read. Hi, Leo! Welcome in, gamer! Skyrim is just. Uh, Starfield's just Skyrim in space. I haven't played Starfield yet, and honestly, I don't know if I'm going to. <laughs> Because I feel like everything I've heard about Starfield is like, it's Skyrim in space, but I don't like vanilla Skyrim. Deadass. Like, I, if it weren't for mods, I would not be playing Skyrim every week. Yeah, yeah, this is, she's taking a break, okay? Everyone's been so mean to her. She's been walking her ass off. She's taking a sit and taking a break to read this stone. <laughs> okay, Waylon, you've been chosen to strike fear into the heart of the Nords. Go to the market tomorrow. You'll know what to do. See, this is why I could never be part of a cult. Because if someone gave me a message, they'd be like, you'll know what to do, Evie. I'd be like, no the fuck I don't. I have autism. I don't, that could mean anything from like, rob somebody, stab somebody, be mean to someone at a Starbucks. What do you mean? Give me step-by-step -step instructions. I don't know what to, I do not know what to do. Like, that would not work for me. Okay, I could never, like, I could never be in a cult. Like, they wouldn't want me. You know what I mean? Like, I, I'm just, uh, it'll go over my head, okay? It'll go over my head. All right, let's see. Now that we have that, though, we just need to find evidence on one more person. Who's the other person we need evidence on? Yeah, well, we have to find out who N is. Maybe this is like, is this like an L from Death Note type scenario? Uh, but before we do that, I'm gonna run an ad real quick. Um, cause I need some more water. I'm all out of water. Um, and I'm thirsty. <laughs> so I'm not even to take someone out. I'll give you an instant. Yeah, if someone was like, all right, Evie, take him out. I'd be like, do you wanna go see that Barbie movie? <laughs> like, I would just take them out on a date. Like, they'd be like, okay, how'd it go? And I'd be like, oh my God, we kissed and held hands in the parking lot. <laughs> like, that's literally what would happen. But we are gonna do an ad break real quick because I'm thirsty. Oh, I'm so Tier one gamer, welcome in. I apologize, we're taking a quick one minute break so I can refill my water. But we will be right back. Well, let me do the the ad thing. There used to be, I used to have like a little widget that was like run an ad at this time. Okay, here we go. There we go. Run ad break, and we'll do that real quick. And then I will go get more water and a little snacky. So if you've been watching the stream since the beginning, go to the bathroom, go get water, go get a little snacky if you need to. Okay, I will be right back. Where's my button? Oh, that's the wrong button. Okay, fuck. Okay, button and button, button, and then I mute my mic. Huzzah!
Did everyone get their water? Did everyone get a snack? Cause I got a snack. I got two cookies. And I had a little like M and M's in them. They were very good. Best VRB screen. Thank you. I made it myself. See, I thought about commissioning. Because you can commission people to make really pretty screens for you. Like my starting soon screen, I commissioned someone to make for me. And I love it. I think it's gorgeous. You know what I'm saying? You've oh. been digging around where you don't belong. It's time you've learned a lesson. Do you know what happens during this quest line? Hee <laughs> hee. Beef jerky. Oh, fuck yeah. Good snack. Listen. Do I know what's happening? Yes. Am I going to directly spoil it? No, because I'm feeling like a good noodle, but <laughs> is all I shall say. Okay. Uh, who, who sent you? Actually, no, let me be sassy. Who sent you? Someone who doesn't like you asking questions. That doesn't answer Come my... On. Oh, fuck. Let's okay. Um, I guess we're, we're going. Okay. Um. Yeah. Wait, do I just have to brawl him? I can't use my magic? Because if I can use my magic, I can kick yeah. your ass. Oh, God. I'm just a little girl. I'm just a little lady. Okay, oh fuck. Okay, I'm not winning this fight. From me. What happens if I fail the fight? Okay, oh, oh shit, okay, fuck. Oh God, I need to lock on. That's right, that's right. Okay, I am literally a little princess. I am God's favorite princess and the prettiest girl in school. And I will not have you best me. <laughs> oh shit, okay, he might be besting me. Okay, don't best me, don't best me. Okay, don't best me, don't best me. Don't best me, don't best me, don't best me. Please don't best me. Oh, we're winning, oh, oh, okay. Ah, okay. Hi, Nitty. Hi, Nitty Kitty. Welcome in, Gabriel. I have survived tummy aches. I am the bravest uh, bitch here. You mangy piece of pit bait. Yeah? Huh? You like that? You like them? I, I have a stutter. Talk, talk, or I send you to the gods. I was sent by Nepos the Nose. The old man hands out the orders. He told me to make sure you didn't get in the way. That's all I know. I love how she's still squared up. Just <sighs> okay. So I guess that's who N is. Nepos the nose. They really should call him like two N or something like that. Okay, because that's the, the just the one N is a little misleading. Did, did he have more to say? Because he was just like I was sent by this guy and then and then walked away. Okay. Well, I guess we'll go back in here and see if there's any other tea we can get. But um, damn. All right. Um, Nepos is in charge. Okay, his dialogue caught off, but Nepos is in charge. So let's see if we can find him. Does he have a room in here? Mm hmm Garvey, garlic bread. Can you imagine if your name was garlic bread? I wish my name was garlic bread. Let's see, Nepos. We're looking for a Nepos. Are you naked? No, you're just like that. Okay. Need something? No, I'm good. Um, he doesn't live there. Oh, okay. It says I need to find evidence about him though. Although I mean, there might be someone I could talk to who will tell me Nepos something. Nepos is in charge. That's all I know. Okay. Um, you don't want to be here. No, no, I don't. <laughs> I do not. Uh, I do not know where Nepos is. No. I figure he's probably... Actually, no, I think I do know where he's in. Isn't he in the tavern or something like that? Isn't he in the inn? I think he is. I don't know. Uh, that's right. He's a noble. That's right. So I think he is in the inn. Oh, in his house. Oh. Okay. Well, let's look I around then. The night because the werewolves and vampires don't. Yeah, you, you, you stick with that, buddy. You stick with that, okay? All right, well, let's head over and see if we can find his house. And then I guess we'll just do some good old breaking and entering. He's in uh, the cloud district. Okay, so he's in the big boy part of Markarth then. The big boy part. What's over here, though? Oh, that's just Skyrim. <laughs> I was like, what are we going to do in here? Oh, you're fucking dead. Do you have any bones I can take? I mostly deal with petty thieves. Yeah, give me that bone. Okay, thank you. All right, uh, I'm going to check back at the tile shrimp for payment for each piece of evidence. Oh, I forgot about that. We're let's grab, Marcus. let's go in here and then we'll go back to the tile shrine. Cause I totally forgot you could get fucking paid for this quest. I, uh, listen, I love money. Oh. <laughs> the game crashed. <laughs> anyway, um, let's just, uh, that's fine. We'll just start it again. Nothing bad will happen. We'll just. Start it again. Yippee! Okay, where's Gim? Vortex, there we go. Alright, just open it again, okay? <laughs> no money for you! Yeah, the game literally is like, stay broke, bitch! And I'm like, shit, okay. Alrighty, game, whatever you say. <laughs> I told you Skyrim was combustible. Combust these nuts in your mouth! <laughs> I'm sorry. You were just trying to be nice. 
and I was the worst. I'm sorry. I joined a scuff at listen. I don't think we've had as many fucked up moments this have we? I don't think I've been in as fucked up as I have on past streams. You know? But there, there, there truly is no good time to enter my stream. I like the question of it crashed an awful lot for me. I sat down and deleted a lot of stuff I wasn't interested in and it got better. Yeah, I have added a lot of stuff. I don't know how many mods my loader is. At. Oh, okay, did the little beatboxing. That means it's going. But I definitely think, like, with the collection, there's no shame in, like, if you don't like something, take it out, you know? As long as you, like, and that's why I'm glad there's the Discord section for altering the collection, because, like, a lot of people do it. It's just, it can be, you'd never know, like, what depends on what. You know what I mean? Like, you take out something, and then everything else breaks. <laughs> okay. Load. Where was my last save? Because I have no fucking idea. I'm going to be honest. All right. Continue from last save. Hopefully, it'll, it'll be okay. I just got I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry. It just... I don't think before I speak, and it just... It's where my brain went. Okay? That's... That's all I got. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Hmm. It crashed again! Okay. <laughs> Third time's the charm? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sometimes it doesn't do work if I do continue, but if I load the specific save, it works. And we can always go back to an old save, worst case scenario. Because um, I think I did save pretty recently, or at least I should have an auto save. But at least we can get to the main screen. That's the biggest thing. Mine likes to crash if I open the quest log while my map is open. Yeah, sometimes it crashes for just no damn reason. Like, it very well I could be, I open it again, do the exact same thing, and then it's fine. You know? Um, I do know that disk space was an issue for me today when I was troubleshooting my mod list. Because it was one of those things where, like, literally yesterday it worked perfectly fine. And then I sat down 30 minutes before stream, and it didn't work. And it's because my disk was <laughs> overloaded <laughs> somehow. Um, Skyrim felt betrayed. It didn't understand you needed to break. It did not! It was so rude to me, and for what? You know, my likes to crash if I die. But I have that mod that has you not die but wake up somewhere else. I like that mod. So I actually, sometimes I like that mod because I know what you're talking about. But sometimes I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> like, cause it'll spawn me like way back in. You know what I mean? And then I'm just like, damn. Okay, let's try loading the specific save. Banya, auto, marker. Let's go back to this one, just to be safe. And if that doesn't load, then I don't fucking know what to do. <laughs> Alright, we'll, we'll fix it. I do keep backups of all my saves, though, so we should be okay. Hello? Huh? Okay, so... Um... Awkward! Okay, I guess I'll have to do some troubleshooting then. And I'll see... This might just be God telling me it's time to stop. <laughs> Let me see. Do I have too much running? Because I just cleared out my, my C drive. Let me double check. That's the one thing I'll double check. But we might just have to call it early here for tonight. Which sucks, but I can't really... It could be I need to free up more stuff. But I do have all my saves here. So if we need to fix something, we can. But I guess this is the Lord above telling me <laughs> it is time to quit, unfortunately. So I guess we'll end here for today. Um, I'm not really, like, I, I'm pretty sure we can get it fixed. Because I was having issues earlier, but I can probably fix it, honestly. And I'm looking. Yeah, I have all my save games, so we should be fine. Um, yeah, I think we'll be okay. But, um, we will do our last poll. I've been not <laughs> I guess so. Um, Skyrim said, hey, fuck you. And I guess that's just, uh... That's just where we're at. Which, like, on one hand, there's part of me that's like, that's not how I wanted to end my first stream back. But it also is like, yeah, that that adds up. Yeah. So I'm confident that I can fix it. Todd Howard crashing your game so you buy Starfield. No, I don't want to play Starfield. I don't want to be in space. I want wedges. <laughs> but it is a very EB core way to end this stream. So, we do have one more. Um, I'll give you, if you type exclamation point raffle, you can enter our raffle to get one month free of Nexus Premium. Um, it just works. It just works. Um, I guarantee you I'm going to go look at it after stream and then it's going to be fine. It, it's literally probably just stream curse, honestly. Um, but worst case scenario, I'll, I, I might, what I might do, worst case is I might load an even older save than that and just do shit off stream to get me back on track. Um, but I can definitely figure it out. But, um, I'm
I'm giving away one more month of Nexus Premium. So if you want to download the collection, but you don't want to have to deal with clicking all the buttons and stuff, um, this will be your opportunity to get that. A little binding off stream, if you will. Yes, yes, yes. Um, but before I pull the last one, thank you all for coming out tonight. I really appreciate it. I think Jinkla has already posted the links, but if you could post them again. Um, I do have a Discord, which if you win the raffle, I will need to, you to join the community Discord so I can find you. <laughs> um, I do have a Discord, a Twitter, uh, all of that jazz. Um, I will be uploading this VOD on YouTube. I'm also gonna see, maybe I might start doing edited down VODs of Skyrim Sunday. I'm not sure, honestly, yeah, I'm not sure. But if you missed the beginning of the stream, that will be posted on YouTube. Uh, and that's all my other miscellaneous social media. So thank you gamers so much for coming out. Let's do our last raffle pull. Close entries. Close, close, close. Pick winner. Entangle, you have won the last Nexus Premium. Congratulations, gamer. If you could just uh, message me on Discord, I will get you your Nexus Premium tonight. So congratulations, all the winners. I think it was Akla, Entangle, and Pasta. So I will be messaging you about getting your Nexus Premium. But thank you, gamers, all so much for hanging out. Uh, let's see who we can go raid. We'll do a very classic Skyrim raid. Oh, I'm sorry, Ash. We are, oh, what the fuck? There's sound going on? No, I don't want sound. Ah! Unfortunately, we have to end stream here because um, Skyrim crashed three times in a row and I was like, okay, that means it's time to go. <laughs> that means it's time to go. Um, We will go raid. Hmm, great stream to cite this up. Thank you, gamer. I appreciate it. Um, boop, 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 boop. We will go raid. I don't know who we're going to raid. I don't really see anyone I know. I'm always nervous about raiding new people because I'm like, what if I raid someone and then they're like, really like racist <laughs> or something like that. So maybe we won't end with a raid tonight. That's okay. But gamers, thank you all so much for hanging out. I will catch you on the flip side. I will be posting my stream schedule soon, probably tonight. And we are, we are fucking back, baby. I will see you again on Wednesday. Uh, we're going to be doing a viewer vote again for what we play on Wednesday. And I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye,